All right, hello and welcome back to the Crossword Vlog, aka Clog. Um, we're just gonna get right into it and try to solve this Tuesday puzzle. Um, shrimp scampi, I know is a thing. I don't know, that just jumped right out at me. Uh, and Divins, I don't know what that is. Um, oh. Okay, so this this looks like a joke, <laughs> believe it or not. What did the clock do when it was still hungry? It went back four seconds, like a clock might go back seconds. Happy to always explain jokes for people to make sure that <laughs> everyone laughs. Um, worshipful love could be adoration. A uh, smidgen could be a mite. I don't care one mite is a frames. Oldies but goodies might be played on jukeboxes. Um, pay for something expensive. You could foot the bill. That's a classic um, idiom. One six hundred and fortieth of a square mile. I did not know that was the case, but that must be acre just based off of the letters. Oh, and I guess divins are sofas because um, ska is a music genre as well. Monomaniacal captain of fiction. No idea. I think I've read Who's Afraid of Virginia Woolf, but I haven't. I'll I'll come up with his name eventually. The author. Um, a a locus of points. No. Um. Uh. Hoi you can be hoisted by your own petard. That's a phrase. So maybe hoist here. Um, or foisted. Okay, knee part could be an ACL, like when you tear an ACL. Uh, I guess monomaniacal would be Ahab. He had a single focus. A lo sets of points, not set of points. So it is loci. Um, just had the pluralizations wrong. Edward Albin? Hmm. An ETF is something that you would buy on the market. Um, no, because you a golfer might have a pocket full of teas. Um, bill someone probably. Uh, Acer. This has been showing up a lot in crosswords recently. Um, so I've learned that Acer is a Taiwanese computer brand. Uh, you can cool a pie on the sill. Um, an archaeologist, archeo sorry, archaeologist could find a relic. Um, spring. Huh. Face the music. Um, another idiom. Autumn, also known as fall. Uh, Ariel is a sans serif font, similar to Helvetica. Ivan the Terrible must have been a czar. I guess Ishtar gate, sure. Um, a Reuben has like rye bread has pastrami, I thought, but obviously neither of those fit. Um, shade of gray, don't know. Uh, after five or after pie comes row, I guess. Um, you can hone a knife, ash gray. Um, all right. Temper extremes, you can have highs and lows. I think a high of 75 today. Um, to be or not to be. So, um, Shakespeare famously wrote in iambic pentameter. Iams are 
I wish I could tell you. <laughs> I was really hoping my brain would come up with what those were. But it's like the da 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 that sort of like rhythm in language to be or not to be. Um, so for example, like take responsibility for a misdeed wouldn't fit into iambic pentameter because you can't say it like that. You can't say like take responsibility for a misdeed, like it just doesn't flow as nicely, I guess. <laughs> Sorry for anyone who actually knows what iambic pentameter is, but that's my understanding. Um, let me think. Hmm. Or it could be um, let me think. Um, uh, Bill Earp or something? If you wear the crown, you may reign. Donkeys? Hee haw. <laughs> um, boots from office. Um, ousts, maybe? Cousin It is a Adam's family. Sounds of hesitation could be Ur's. Um, dog hotel, maybe? A uh, boarding kennel is like a place that you would put a pet. Um, for a while, so a dog hotel would be fancier. Um, shoulder the burden, shoulder the weight, no, shoulder the something for misdeed. Um, this looks a little off, but it could be right. Oh, sour kraut. That could make sense. And it's Ariel, so it's sauerkraut like that. Um, reuse, get more mileage out of. And then I guess rag, because ragtime is a genre. So I guess maybe you could compose rags. Um, protect, protection could be shield. Nope, <laughs> that didn't fit. Uh, bum around London. Don't know. Um, something the something maybe. Um, I guess the quarterbacks call the plays usually. Mushers vehicles, uh, sleds. So uh, like when you're in the Iditarod or like a dog race, you like mush um dogs uh like sled dogs um so a a jd is a juris doctorate um who might take the the bar exam but also might take the lsat um i think the bar once you pass the bar you have a jd maybe um a flea circus is a thing so performers in a Tiny circus could be please. Uh, an issue could be debated. Um, have a meal, just eat, nothing fancy there. Uh, okay. Gasoline or kerosene are both fuels. Uh, and then Lima is the capital of Peru. Uh, okay. Forbidden sounding fragrant fragrance. So all I'm seeing there is that it ends with you, but it could be taboo because it sounds like taboo, like with two O's. Um, kind of going out on a limb there, but uh, it could be right. Be like apial, maybe? I, I know an apiary is like a beehive or like a bee house or something. Um, so apia something could be bee related. Um, back the field, I think. Could be. Leaves in a hurry, bolts, bolts out of there. A small music group. Maybe like a combo. Hmm. 
football.at. I'll come back to that area. Esau is a name of a biblical twin. Just happen to know that. A bear in Spanish. I thought it was Ursa. Um, but maybe not. Misplaced could be lose. Could be Uso. Um, This could be something the, because all these other ones are something the, something. Um, An EMT would be trained in CPR. Emoted, classic crosswordies thing, shows up all the time. Uh, nuclear trials for short. Come back to that. Uh, rage quits. Uh, angrily stop playing. Stops playing a game. That's a classic. Uh, a donkey can bray. That's that's what the donkey says. Um, I wonder if triumphant shout could just be yes. Um, seems a little too straightforward, but maybe not. Zhao and Lai, I think. I think. Summer or spring roll, those are things, yep. Air bubbles might be released while scuba diving. Ioni sky, sure. Um, I guess it must be um, <laughs> uh, instead of hmm. Lublai? Kublai Khan, Bill Keen. Kublai Khan for sure. Huh, I guess his name only has a single L in it. Interesting. Who, me? Maybe am I? Shoulder the blame. Could just be yes. Protection. Aegis. Um, uh, Aegis, I think, was the name of a mythical shield. Um, and I think it's used metaphorically. Um, Shakespeare was a bard. Um, bum around London. Arse, okay. Um, because around London, like in the area near London, aka, okay, you know, anywhere in England, uh, you would, instead of saying bum, you might say arse. Um, Back the field, Alf. This just doesn't look quite like a name. Um, but maybe it's okay. Little twerp. Hmm. Little Turk could be a snot, a little snot. Um, and this could just be combo. Mm. Come back to that. Something tests. Big chip off the old block. I was wondering if that could be like a flow, like an ice flow. Toes the line. Also, could that? Yeah, that could be right. Um, nuclear trials. Huh. It's kind of a messy end here, but I'll do my best. Um, small musical group. Could it be anything other than combo? Iberian wine city. I wonder if this would just be Oporto or something. 
The Iberian Peninsula, where is that again? That's like Spanish. Um, football stat could be ATT. That doesn't mean much to me, but Gibson Alther, Althea Gibson, maybe A tests. Oh, I was really not expecting that to be right. If I'm being a hundred percent honest, um, let's go ahead and admire the puzzle. I was, I was so sure. Either this or this was going to be wrong, um, but luckily it wasn't. I would say I liked this puzzle overall. I think this cross is and this cross are both pretty problematic. Um, I enjoyed my solving experience, don't get me wrong, I had a good time, but I was actually like completely shocked that <laughs> these were both correct. Um, like, this is just sort of like a random name to me. And ATT, I still don't know what that means. Um, like, I, I don't even really have a guess. Like, assisted assisted something, maybe. Um, and then Althea, definitely the most likely name, but A tests. Um, I would kind of have preferred if this was like... Um, in some way uh, clued with respect to A-B testing. Um, it's just like nuclear trials, right? It could be like R tests, like for radiation. It could be like, I don't know, <laughs> like any letter really. Um, so like, like you don't feel very confident when you, when you fill in something there. Um, but otherwise I, I did like, uh, I, I did like the the little bit of the theme uh, that was going on here. Basically just idioms that happen to have the word the in them. Uh, nothing too crazy. You know, foot the bill, face the music, shoulder the blame, back the field and toes the line. Um, back the field I wasn't familiar with, but it, 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 it sounds like a real thing. And it was gettable, like back as in bet on, and then the field meaning like, all the all the things on the field it, it, it made sense to my brain um so i didn't i didn't feel too bad about that uh i was also pretty i, I felt pretty favorably to the inclusion of rage quits um as one of the long uh fill words seemed pretty cool um dog hotel is all right um air bubbles seemed nice and you know adoration is is whatever um but like you know i'm always pro long fill and these are definitely um solid long fill words uh on the whole i would give it a respectable but not out of this world 6.5 out of 10. um anyway thanks for watching uh appreciate the support see you next time